Hey guys, it's Sharon from Digital Nomad Quest, and today I'm gonna to share with you guys a story about how I had to evict a tenant because they were not paying rent. So in the beginning, it was all good. The tenant was making their monthly payments, but all of a sudden, they started delaying their payments. Basically, they were supposed to pay by X date or before that date, but it was delayed by like a week, then two weeks, and three weeks, and longer and longer, and they just kept making all these excuses like, oh, I'm going to get a check soon. I'm gonna pay you soon, but it just never came. So we gave some verbal warning Warnings and there's still no improvement. So we told the property manager, hey, let's like send a written notice. But the tenant didn't respond to our written notice. So we basically had to hire a lawyer to process the eviction. Now the tenant and the property manager showed up at court. They reached some type of agreement and they were supposed to meet the terms, but the tenant didn't meet the terms again. So they had to go to court again. And it just kind of lingered for a long time until the tenant finally moved out. But the tenant didn't pay like several months of rent. Fortunately, they didn't make like large damages to the house but it was like a one-year process from when they were delaying payments to basically moving out so I ended up losing a few months rent I had to pay lawyer fees I had to pay repair fees I also had that vacancy time where I had to look for a new tenant which is money lost as well and that had fees as well to find a new tenant and for some reason at the end the tenant tried to sue me um, I remember I was scared because I had never been sued before but ultimately I wasn't sure if I did anything wrong I don't think I did anything wrong right so my property manager showed up to the court hearing but they didn't show up and it was postponed and they didn't show up again so the case was dismissed ultimately so basically that was a summary of my eviction process that took about a year's worth of time it was kind of stressful but I've seen cases that are worse than this like there can be other cases where the tenants kind of illegally do business in their house or the tenants have negative relationships with their neighbors people having high turnaround rates with tenants so they have a lot of vacancy and have a lot of problems and have to keep finding new tenants you know right now I'm in a good position I think so I'm pretty grateful ultimately and I learned a lot from this experience so that essentially concludes my eviction story let me know in the comments below if you've ever had to evict a tenant and if you like this video make sure to like it and share it as well as subscribe if you haven't already hit that bell button to be notified of my latest videos and I will see you guys in the next one